Hello everyone, welcome back with FreeCAD 3D Modeling Basic Tutorial for exercise number 13. First, we can create new drawings, change into part design, click create body, create sketch, choose a top plan, and use a circle command to create circle at this point. We create a two circle, use a these tools to change the circle radius into 30. And the next uh, circle, we can set radius into 20. Click close. Click pad tools to convert into 3D. And I will set length or extrusion into 35. The next, create body again. And select at this face. Click a create sketch. Click OK. So in here, we have uh, two body. You can see. The next create circle start from this point, also in here. Set a distance between uh, these two circles. In horizontal, we set into 60. The next for radius in the circle 25. And uh, the circle into 30. Create line. Okay, start from this point into here. Create again in here. The next, use uh, this tool, vertical dimension, to set a dimension into 25. Also in it, we can set into 25. And then use a trim command to cut uh, the circle. We cut again in a uh, design object. Also at the circle. Click close. And use pet tools to convert this cat into 3D models. You can click here, pet. Set for length into 15. And I will use a reverse. Click OK. Select at this face. Click uh, create cat. And use uh, these tools to create a reference edge. Create circle, start from this point. And I will set for radius into 15. The next click close. Use pet tools. We can extrude with extrusion 3. Click OK. So it will be automatically extrude. Now we can create hole in this space. Click uh, this space and create sketch. We use these tools to create a reference edge and create circle in the center point. We set for reduce into 10. Click close and use pad, this, uh, this packet tools to create hole. We set length into 30. Click OK. So it will be create holes. You can see. The next, we create new body again. You can click here, create body. You can see we have a uh, three body. And for sketch, we can select at this face. Click create sketch. Choose a make independent copy. Create circle. Start from this point. Create again in here. We can set a distance between this two circle. I will set into 70. The next for radius in the circle 30. And at the circle we set into 20. We create line, start from this point into here. Create again at this point. The next, you can use uh, this tool, stangen. We connect between this uh, line and this circle. Okay, connect again in here. The next at this point. And in here. Okay. You can create line in here to create a reference line. Click into this point. And the next, use uh, these tools to create angle from this line into here. We can set into 37 degree for angle. Click OK. Now you can use a uh, trim command. You can click here, trim. We cut this line. Also in uh, this point. And at uh, this uh, point. You can click uh, this uh, circle. You can uh, cut. Okay, now you can click close and use pet tools to convert into 3D. Uh, sorry, 
we need to delete uh, this line objects you can right click in sketch for edit sketch select this line and we can press delete button now in here we can use trim tools select at this uh, edge will be trim out click close and now use pet tools to convert into 3d we can set for length into 15 okay select at this face click uh, quad sketch i will use these tools to set a reference edge quad sketch circle in uh, this uh, center point we can set for radius for the circle into 10 i'm uh, sorry 15 click ok the next quad line start from this point into here quad again from this point to this point and in that we can we have the uh, distance between uh, these uh, all lines click at this point click at this uh, point into this uh, line sorry in here we can click and select at this line we can set into 5 for this time also in here set into 5 the next in uh, this point 5 and the last in uh, this point into 5 you can press exit button to close uh, these tools and select up this line object press delete button we create a circle in here and you can set for reduce into 30 now you can use trim command we can trim this uh, circle this uh, line object also at this point this line and uh, this uh, circle object you can click close and use pet tools to convert into 3d we can set for extrusion 5 click ok now we can combine uh, these uh, three bodies you can click model we have uh, this uh, three body and for body one you can click a uh, toggle active body the next you can use boolean tools for add body you can select uh, these objects click ok and i will click at uh, this face we can use a fillet tools i will set into two for fillet okay the next you can right click in a body to click a toggle active body and now use bullet tools you can bullet with uh, this body you can click at body select after this face and you can click okay so to be automatically combined between these all three bodies i will select in this face and we can use the fillet tools we set into two Okay, the next select uh, in this face, we can use fillet. Okay, and we can set for radius into 2. Click OK. For the last, you can create holes in here. You can select at this face. We can create sketch. And I will use uh, this uh, reference uh, edge quad circle start from this point and i will set for radius into 2 sorry into 10 and you can use a bucket tools to create hole you can set for length into 50 and click ok so it will be a quad hole in this point okay enough today for free basic tutorial for exercise number 13 if you have any question about this tutorial, you can comment below this video.